contribution to the mission ExoMars of Elital SRL Italian Electronics. ExoMars mission is designed to explore the planet Mars using a robotic probe developed by the European Space Agency ESA and the Russian Space Agency Roscosmos. It provides the launch of an orbiter and a rover in 2020. Main scientific objectives are to study the biological environment and looking for any traces of life, to characterize the geochemistry and water distribution, to learn about the Martian surface in anticipation of future human space flights, to increase knowledge of the Martian environment and geophysics. Other objectives include the development of technologies in various fields, necessary for the success of future robotic missions and space flights. Elital has designed and built the on-ground transportation and handling system commonly named spacecraft transport containers. This video will demonstrate how to build a transport system for satellites. From design to system tests going through the manufacturing of every single component. Over 20,000 hours of labor, 2 years of work, 15,000 components for a system of more than 9 tons to protect the rover that will explore Mars during ground transportation. This is for Elital, the ExoMars Rover 2020 transportation system. The process is complex and begin for a phase of 3D project with CAD systems to then be analyzed with structural analysis softwares. We then proceed with the creation of every single part according to drawing. It continues with the assembly in various subsystems. The main assembly technology and more delicate one is the welding. The cradle which houses the ExoMars rover is the most valuable element of the system. This is why the Elital choose to use only precious materials because they are durable and can guarantee high levels of cleanliness and then very low levels of contamination to meet ESA's plan planetary protection requirements. Through these rules, the contamination from spores and terrestrial bacteria of other planets and celestial bodies is prevented during scientific exploration missions. This is both to safeguard ecosystems and both to compromise future scientific research. For this reason, both the rover and all that is in close contact with the rover must be compatible with high levels of cleaning and sterilization. As in a tailor shop, the assembly is basted through The rover must be protected against external environmental conditions such as vibrations, shocks, crashes, temperature or humidity but also from contamination of spores and bacteria. The DHMR treatment phase is the final phase of sterilization. This treatment is performed in Elital with its own equipment and is one of the few national companies that can perform planetary protection treatments for large systems and weights. The system is then completed by an external container that has the task of bringing inside not only the container with the rover but also all the systems and accessories needed during the trip. It is specially designed because personalization is so important on structures that it makes no sense to use standard parts. The bearing structure of the outer container is also made by welding. A cell is built to guarantee the optimal condition of transport, but also to be able to protect the contents from accidental damage that could occur during transport. The inner container cover is treated to have the surface suitable to be cleaned and decontaminated. Particular attention is paid to surface finishing corners and welds. 
After the painting process, the external container is placed in the assembly and integration area, starting from the internal equipping and the electrical harnesses mounting, we move on to the assembly of all the remaining components. The outer container in the back side houses the accessories and tools necessary for the rover during the travel phase. The front side of the outer container is a clean room at ISO 8 cleanliness class and it houses the internal container on the system of rails and conical couplers that have the task of blocking the system during the trip. This is the cradle where the rover is anchored for the tree. It is locked on the body and on each wheel. The system studied allows to adapt the anchoring position to the spatial angles where each wheel will be through mobile interfaces with 4 degrees of freedom. system is assembled, each subsystem is tested in order to verify the correct construction and functionality. In fact, the transport system is autonomous in the loading and unloading phases to the customer's clean room. Therefore, to complete the process, the ramps necessary for accessing the internal container are provided. Inside the first customer's clean room, the external container will be opened. The internal container undergoes various cleaning and decontamination phases before being able to access the biocontaminating clean room. Only after this stage can the inner container be opened. Responding to the requirements of planetary protection was one of the greatest difficulties we encountered on ExMars. The container will undergo the DHMR process practiced in Elital, which is organized with an internal chamber able to meet the requirements of ACSS regulations. Despite the size and weight of the internal container is higher than the classification of the ACSS themselves. Now we are looking for the 3D model describing how the rover is anchored to the transport cradle. In the simulation we are looking for how the lid is closed by a pair of centering pins that ensures that the cover is guided during the assembly phase. The single cover has a weight of over 800 kilograms. During the project development, various simulations are performed. Also, the functionality of the system kinetics shall test on the mathematical model. The internal container is able to get on and off thanks to a remote control system on the external container. To perform the structural tests, let's see the dummy mass that simulates the weight of the rover. The structure of the cradle is loaded in such a way that it can perform structural, fold and measurement tests of shock accelerations, etc. Cover is lowered and the gaskets on the cradle below guarantee the sealing of the internal environment. valves of the container are mounted on the doors, allow the air to flow from inside and outside and vice versa, so that pressure is equalized during the journey. The air from the outside goes from the inside, undergoes three cleaning phases, ensuring a degree of ISO 8 cleaning as For the final system tests, the crane is required. Let's see the drop test. In this way, the structure is stressed and thanks to additional sensors with the vibrational analysis done during the design.
Total Weight Measurement, Balancing Test and Full Load Test are the last tests before shipping. The advantage offered by Elital Transport Systems is the compatibility with the anchors of each truck. In this way, the costs are contained and all the logistics phases are optimized, as the presence of the ISO corners on our structure makes available a world series of accessories designed for marine containers. contribution to the Exomars 2020 mission.